and five, four, three, two, one. Hello everybody, this is Steve Hahn coming at you from Headwaters to Ocean Trout Fitter. I'd like to spend a few minutes today talking about river safety while fishing and wading in Yukon's rivers. As you know, we have high water right now and there's a lot of debris, hazards and wood inside the river and we want to be as safe as possible. Before we get going, I'd like to thank the Hunter Education Program as well as the Yukon Fish and Game Association for helping us out and making sure that we all stay safe when we're in the, wo in the woods. Okay. The first step in staying safe in the river is utilizing quality equipment. As modern waders are a lot more form-fitting, lightweight, as well as don't have a lot of bagginess in them. And if you take an accidental swim, they'll avoid the situation of filling up with water. Modern wader boots are lightweight as well as offer support, and they allow you to swim with greater ease and intent. The number one hazard when wearing waders is not wearing a proper form-fitting fabric wading belt. Without it, your waders will fill with water and you'll sink to the bottom. The number one piece of wading equipment that I never leave home without is my PFD. Your choices are form-fitting inflatable or fashionable foam. The benefits of the inflatable life jacket is it is form-fitting and comfortable and will only inflate when required. The benefits of the foam life jacket is you always have flotation when you need it and there's extra protection for your body should you fall onto rocks. When wading rivers, it's important that you don't wade above your waist. You move deliberately with small steps and carry a wading staff to make sure that you have extra stability. If you do find yourself in the water, remain calm, breathe normally, pull your PFD if it needs to inflate, get onto your back and use your feet to push away from wood and rocks. Eddies are the calm bits of water behind points and rocks, and these are the best places to get into should you be in the water in the main current. Above all, if you find yourself in the river, don't fight the current. Swim downstream at a 45 degree angle and swim towards the shore you want to be on. Let's do that one more time. <laughs> 